guys Senjo here welcome to my channel Texo Academy in today's video just a quick one I'm going to be walking you through on understanding who your audience are we're going to be talking extensively on niche hack okay who are your audience who is your audience okay we're going to be walking you through on the types of audience you have and how best to engage them and more importantly I'm going to be sharing with you tips on how to convert your cold audience into a hot audience they, 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 uh, there's this popular saying that the money is on the list okay now the money is actually in your hot audience okay I'm going to be explaining to you in a short why the three types of audience we have and how to convert the cold audience and the warm audience into a hot audience where the dollars are all right so watch this video down to the end in order to mix out in any important information i'm going to be sharing with you right in this video having said that if you're yet to subscribe to this channel kindly hit that subscription button down below this video and smash that bell icon so as to be notified when next i post another amazing video that you won't like to miss okay so let's dive in into what we have for today so your audience are people who are actually um who might be interested in what you have to offer there are visitors into your website into your facebook page into your offer into your event whatever it is that you're offering okay they are just um uh, uh, visitors down there okay who can actually or uh, turn out to be your customers they can turn out to be your subscribers they can turn out to be whatever you want them to be okay but in this video i'm going to be classifying who these guys are to you so that you better appreciate how uh, to engage with each and every section of uh, the types of audience that we have okay so we actually have three types of audiences okay now cold audience we have the warm audience and we have the hot audience and i'm going to be starting from the peak down to the last okay now we we have the hot audiences now who are your hot audience your hot audience are people or they are visitors who have recently visited your website okay now let me let me demonstrate this for you guys all right now your your hot audience are people who have actually bought something from you they already know who you are they have they have had a deal with you before they already know what you are capable of doing they know what you are what you have to offer they know the kind of value that you have to offer they have actually had a relationship with you okay they have demonstrated a extremely high engagement when they were with you all right either on your website they've clicked on the add to cart button they've clicked on that buy buffing they've they've actually uh, um they have actually taken a significant not just a significant um action on whatever you have to offer but they have actually they are actually inside your sales funnel all right in my previous video i actually talked to you guys about a funnel how a funnel looks like all right now your hot audience i'm just going to just take a look at this funnel right now okay right at this point now the funnel is actually large okay your cold audiences are actually large now deep down into your funnel close to the mouth you discover that the funnel is actually small can we say that it's actually small now that small part that small segment is actually where your hot audiences resides do we understand these are people who are who have actually gone so deep with you inside your funnel they have actually taken each and every action you asked them to take why because they trust you these guys don't have issues unlike the cold audience all right they don't have trust issues but there is every likelihood that these guys come turn out to be cold audiences from the hot audience okay at your cold audience into a hot audience and more so more importantly how to retain and increase your hot audience then again we have our warm audience now who are your warm audience 
Now, these guys are the people who have actually visited your website and have taken a significant engagement with your website. They, they've probably viewed your, your products, your service, your offer, your event, okay? But they've not clicked on that buy button, all right? So, this is just the, the, is, there's just a thin line between the warm audience and the hot audience, okay? So, they, they've, they've actually done every other single thing. They've come to your Facebook page and they've liked your page, they've followed you, and they've actually viewed some of your posts, but they have not actually taken action. All right, they've not taken action such as buffing. All right, they've not clicked on that. They've not bought any product from you. They are. They are I, I, I like to classify them as being on the fence. Okay, they are just on the fence. They are not yet on your right side. They are not yet on your left side. So they are just there. All right. So it is great to re-engage your warm audiences as they have a good likelihood to turn into a hot audience. Or even convert into a sale now these guys have every likelihood to convert all right they have every likelihood to convert all you just need to is to okay they can actually convert real hard for you okay so you you need to put more attention on these guys you need to re-engage them to make sure that they take actions on your page on your offer or on your event on your service product whatever you have to offer all right so the best way to engage these guys is actually through facebook retargeting we are going to be talking that we are going to be talking about that shortly in this video all right code audience now this is where i actually want you to pay attention okay because uh, majority of the internet marketers actually have a cold audience. Now you 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 probably must have heard about um, cold audience, um, cold list, cold email list, um, cold calls, everything cold, right? Now these people who have not been in touch with you, they don't know you, they don't know you are existing, they don't know you have a space in the in the in the industry, they don't have any relationship any kind of relationship with you they, they've not bought anything from you they hardly trust you they, they, they can't even trust you they have trust issues okay so these are people who are it's just like walking into a, a party hall and you're just seeing new faces there all right you don't know them they don't know you okay so you need to start from um an introduction down to um giving them an offer okay so i'm going to be talking to you shortly how you can convert these guys into a hot audience okay so stay with me in this video all right so these guys are actually people who may who, who may not yield high roi for you just like the warm audience and the hot audience but it is important for you guys to re-engage your cold audiences engage them at all time to bring some of them back to your website to bring them back to your page to bring them back to your offer to bring them back to your services that you are rendering online and all of that and you can actually convert these guys into warm audience or hot audiences do we get that okay so now how can you convert your cold audience into a hot audience now take a look at this chart all right now from the left hand side i have my cold audience now it's moving down to the warm audience and then shooting high again into your hot audience and if you watch again you see the hot audience going back to the cold audience i'm going to explain every bit of it to you guys all right so your cold audience i've already explained to you what your cold audience are all right now these guys how can you convert your cold audience into your warm audience or into your hot audience what is the process all right now to convert your cold audience into your you actually need to engage okay you actually need to engage now this is where your copywriting skills has to play out you need to post valuable contents down there you need to post valuable contents on your website on your facebook page on your blog on whatever you have to offer wherever you are, you are, you are channeling it to is it on your youtube page on your youtube channel you need to focus on value okay your value proposition should be high all right you need to post valuable content to this guy so they can gradually learn what you are into understand who you are understand your business and then gradually walk 
into being your warm audience and from there you convert them into your hot audience so it boils down to engagement it boils down to engagement and like i told you guys you need to obey the 80 20 rules okay your 80 percent of your post should be your audience to increase your engagement and conversion all right 80 percent of your post should be engagement you don't have to be um talking about your brand at all times no all right you need to uh, most times you can just give out um a free offer a free webinar a free whatever it is just guide these guys into understanding what you are into then before you give them an offer all right so that's the way sales funnel works so from one step at a time you convert these guys into your hot audiences so now how do you convert your warm audience into your hot audience same thing applies here guys same thing applies you need to engage them as well all right and now there is what we call facebook retargeting facebook retargeting now you've done an ads before right you've done an ad say um seven days ads for 20 bucks and after the seven days what happens right some persons are going to take action on your offer they are going to buy from you or they are going to subscribe to your email list depending on whatever you want to um give to them or whatever you're offering all right now after that what happens to the people who didn't take action on your page or on your offer or on your event what happens to them now this is where facebook retargeting strategy comes to play all right you need to retarget you need to place another ad that is going to be targeting people who have come in contact with you they are no longer strangers to you right now they have probably taken an action like um liking your page or liking your post right and they've gone through your post right so these guys are no longer new to you they're in your warm audience right now okay so to convert them into your hot audience you need to retarget them all right so i'm going to be teaching you how to retarget um your audience your warm audience this channel okay so always check out my youtube channel um i've actually created a playlist on facebook ad success all right so everything about facebook i'm going to be sharing it on that playlist okay so check out this uh, playlist to learn more about how to retarget your warm audience to convert them into your hot audiences and i've told you guys who your hot audience are this is where the money is guys this is where the money is all right so you need to convert your cold audience into your warm audience convert your warm audience into your hot audience and so on and so forth all right so it's possible that you can have 10,000 cold audiences and you can have 100 warm audiences but you can only have um, like five hot audiences it's possible so your goal as an internet marketer is to ensure that you increase your hot audience base all right now another thing that you need to take note of is it is possible for your hot audience to go cold okay it's possible okay let me just give you an instance here now um you actually have a girlfriend um okay uh let me use myself as an instance as an instance all right i actually have this girlfriend previously that i i i I actually want to quit with her okay i don't want to move on with her again so what did i do i actually stopped chatting with her on social media i stopped calling i stopped texting all right whenever she calls most times i pick and i'll be like hey babe i'm busy right now okay i'm going to place this, this call back i'm going to return this call later on all right so gradually the love was going down and down and down all right until we had to cut that relationship okay so the same thing applies here guys it's just a little instance that i give it i gave to you guys all right your your hot audience th there are times that this girl is actually um hot about me. as i started giving her attitude i started um neglecting her calls neglecting her text uh i stopped calling myself and before i know what is going on the girl had to move on okay same thing applies to your online business now these guys are actually hot about you they, they've actually bought things from you they know what you're capable of doing but if you don't keep in touch with them they'll go cold they'll go cold as simple as that 
okay so you need to constantly engage with your hot audiences to keep them alive that is where email email um series uh, actually plays out okay you need to learn email marketing perfectly well in order to engage your hot audiences and to retain them like i told you guys in my previous video we we actually have customer acknowledgement then down to customer acquisition and then customer retention right customer acknowledgement is you knowing who your customers are right then customer um acquisition is trying to understand what appeals to these guys how you can reach out to them how you can convert them into being your your subscribers or your customers right but customer retention is the strategy to keep these guys so inside all of these three things retention is the key right every single person that comes your way in life you need to learn how to retain these guys for maximum profitability so this is where uh, we, we start talking about um, the lifetime value of a customer, right? Someone can actually buy a product from you today and keeps buying and buying and buying and buying. That's why I told you guys, you need to set out your sales funnel, even on Facebook, all right? You need to set out your sales funnel. Inside your funnel, someone can actually buy your front-end product and also buy your upsell, another upsell, another downsell, another downsell, just like that. That's the way a funnel works. It's on autopilot. Whether you're present or not, it's going to keep doing that for you. All right? So that is it, guys. Don't make the mistake of um, not being in touch with your hot audience and always ensure that you are engaging with your cold audiences so that to convert them to warm audience. And for your warm audiences, ensure you do Facebook retargeting in order to convert them to your hot audience. As an internet marketer, like I said before, you need to increase your hot audience. It's as simple as that. So that's it, guys. If you really find value in this video, kindly uh, smash that like button and let me know your thoughts in the comment section below this video. And I will see you in the next one. Hey, don't forget, subscribe to this channel now. Do it now.